Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dreadbread. Welcome to the Space Monkey Mafia. We're going back in time today. We're going back to one of my top favorite JRPGs from PlayStation 1. This is Chrono Cross. I, I love this game. I played this game far more than Final Fantasy 7. Um, so my top... Whoa. Let me just get in here real quick. Uh, my account saying I'm streaming. Good. We're gonna pop in the game real quick. Alright, just making sure it's working. Uh, we're not gonna play Radical Dreamers because that'd be four hours of me just talking. So we're not gonna do that. Whoa! What was all the start of this? When did the cogs of fate begin to turn? Perhaps it's impossible to grasp that answer now, from deep within the flow of time. I'll fix the stream. Hold on. One minute, please. But for a certainty, back then, we loved so many, yet it hated so much. We hurt others, and we hurt ourselves. Yet even then, we ran like the wind, whilst our laughter echoed under Curlian skies. Oh, man, I don't want to... Bastard. Um, what is going on? Change capture, please. And it, nope, that fucked it up. There we go. I don't know why I had to switch capture twice. Uh, this is... Uh, I can't do anything about the lines or the cutoff. That's just how this game plays. Fucking love this game. No, kid! I didn't mean to stab you. I did play a little bit earlier of uh, this earlier just to see how it ran. Um, and it janked up my settings, so I had to refix all that. This is supposed to be on new settings, so the new style. I don't know how many hours I had sunk into this as a kid. Quite a lot. If the volume is messed up, please let me know. Uh, we will be restarting because I didn't do I didn't do much. I just oh my god oh this takes me back oh this takes me back so much man. All right, hold on. There you go. New game, vibration on. There's a lot of little handy fixtures in this. Um, somebody made a video on how to do all this already, because I guess apparently people can't read this or don't want to take the time to read this. But as you can see, I'm using the not PS4 controller or the PS5 controller. I'm actually using the new Xbox controller. You use A to talk, B to run, B to cancel, X to open up key item, uh, key item window, Y for menu. Oh, it's okay. I was pressing. I, I thought I remember the menu being start, but no, start is pause. 
A, and you can see A, confirm, B, cancel. So everything you need to know how to play the game is going to be right here. Bam! And then if you want to use mouse and keyboard controls, which is really nice, that is there too. There's a lot of hate for this right now. Um, people are saying, you know, it's janky, it's bugged, it's no good. Um, could they have done a little bit more with it? Yes. But the game is considerably old, and I didn't think, I don't think there there was a real big following. Sorry, let me say that again. I don't think that Square Enix thought there would be a real big following for this game. Yes, it's beloved by a lot of people, but at the same time, I don't think it got the same love that Chrono Trigger did. Because so I remember playing this in my in my youth. And people just shit all over this game because they didn't understand it. They hated it. You know, it was too confusing. They didn't like the animal characters. They, they thought it was dumb. Um, but that happened with a lot of games I played. Like, I loved Final Fantasy VII. Uh, the, that got shit on constantly because of the art style. Um, so my favorite JRPGs that I can think of right now, there's probably so many more that I I, I haven't thought of in such a long time, but this one for sure, because I was actually thinking, when are they ever going to do a remaster or reboot of this? Final Fantasy VII comes second, because the, those these are the two games that I played the most of. Uh, Jade Cocoon 1 and 2, I really like those games. I never actually owned them. I was only able to rent them, but I still really love that style. I really love those games. And it became really hard to try to find those games as I became older because they were always either super expensive or the copies you'd get were super scratched up and it was a crapshoot on whether or whether or not they would work. But anyway, we are going to be Surge. Uh, confirm. Oh, yeah. <coughs> All right, this is the game where I stopped renaming my characters. Because I wanted to see the characters' true names for themselves. Um, in Final Fantasy VII, I named all my characters crazy things. But this is the game that where I, I kind of grew out of that and really just really just uh, kind of let the, the the default names be the default names. Earlier when I played this, I started off. Ooh, okay, I started off with the. Zappa, alright. What is it, Surge? You look troubled. This is it. No turning back now. Oi! Come on, Surge! Zappa! Just you wait, Lynx. Today is gonna be the day of reckoning. Say your prayers. That'll do you any good. <laughs> Surge! I started off with the, uh... German mermaid lady. But as you can see, we can slow down time. We can speed up time. And then there's all sorts of stuff that you can do, like no random battles, damage buffs, whatnot. Um, I'm not gonna have those on. I don't need those on. Sorry if I'm talking loud, the music is loud on my end, but it should not be on your end. What's that crystal longa thing? Some kind of switch. Bugger! So close! Yet, so far. There is going to be some screen tearing. That's just the way it is. Uh, this... They'll probably patch a bunch of stuff later on. Ba -ba -na 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 -na. But like I was saying, do I have a menu? Oh my god, I do have a menu. Oh. Yeah, they give you the... The shittiest of shit. Ooh. Awesome. I don't have to... I don't remember that being a feature in the regular one. Um, I'm just saying. I do remember having to, like, do this. You equip, and you have to back out. And you do that, and you have to back out. Oh. Customize... Wow, look at that customization. The customization's actually in another, 
Another setup. Time shifter. Elements. Fireball. Bushwhack. Okay. I don't remember how to do any of this stuff. Mega bomb. Mega burst. Okay. Hammer blow. So it looks like we all have kind of the same shit going on. Dash and slash, I remember that. Uh, this is the new art style, by the way. Or not the new art style, but I should have the... already looked at that. Stats recover. Silent protagonist. Age 17. 128. Build ordinary. Right-handed. Damn it. 16. Unknown. Height. 5'5". Five, five. Stunder 100 pounds. Slender. Zappa. Blacksmith. He's only 181 pounds. I thought he'd be, like, more... Maybe more, but... Da 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 da. Da da. But as you can see, you can still switch to who you want to be in charge. Alright, bat thing. I don't remember how combat works. It's a weird stamina thing. Just testing out combat, because this is... BAM! I was kind of a... There we go. Ba -na -na -na. Spoils found nothing! Because you don't get to keep anything in this. Well, hello, and welcome to the stream. Bat, bat, bat. Got him. Again, if the volume is messed up, please let me know. Ba -da -da -da. Spoils found nothing. Um, it's been a very, very long time since I played this game. I'm not gonna lie, I don't remember everything. It's been I don't know how many decades, but quite a quite a bit. Um, there is stuff down there when you come back, but as of right now, no. I'm not going to speed through this because I want you to enjoy the game. Bah. Oh, 
some screen tearing there. I am playing this on the PC. Uh, this did come out for, I think, all consoles. Yay! That's what this does. I don't remember everything. Well, they got squished. try to get a little avatar in the future uh, it's probably just going to I'm just gonna pause this real quick so in case I'm talking too loud or the music's too loud but I am going to let's see if this will pop up uh, no you guys oh yep there it is so I will be putting a little avatar or having somebody create me a little avatar to either put like in the screen here where my mouse think my where my mouse is or maybe over here or maybe kind of in the middle. Um, the reason for that is I, I feel like I need a little bit more um, stuff, some more bells and whistles for my stream. Also, there's been quite a few people. I'm actually going to turn that back on so you don't actually hear the people talking in the background. My dad is watching TV, and he likes to have it quite loud, quite loud. Um, but there's been people going around stealing other people's uh, gameplay footage to make videos and stuff, and I, I don't like that whatsoever. Um, I've had to deal with stuff like that in the past when I first started streaming here on Twitch, and now people are doing it over on YouTube, and those people can go fuck off. <laughs> But yes, the reason why I'm not playing the Radical Dreamer thing, which was the original sequel to Chrono Trigger, which is, it's all text-based. And it's four hours long. Oi! What the bloody hell just happened? What? What? What are we doing here? Oh, bugger! We're so high up! Is this thing floating? Did it feel like your body just passed through the floor just now? That's sure is some foot. Hey, Serge? Huh? You're yeah, right, mate. You've been acting all weird. We... <clears throat> Sorry. We don't know what's up with a head. What's up ahead. So, just stay on your toes, eh? Uh-huh. I know what's up. I do not remember the whole story. I remember beating this game and being kind of confused. I didn't realize there was multiple endings to this. And I restarted this game over so many times to try to get all characters in one go. Didn't realize you couldn't do that at the time. Oh, look at all those def evil chocobos! Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. I always thought this shit was cool. Hopefully you guys aren't hearing the TV downstairs. Search! Good morning, Search. Come on, sleepyhead. Get up. Yeah, I'm gonna have to mute that if I can hear it. You guys can mute it. Fuck. Ba-da-da. 
nothing in the bed oh wait yes there is search check out Serge's not so secret savings do you like to rest no not now I did that earlier and it wouldn't do anything he just all right and then you can close the blinds ba -da 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 -da. good morning Serge you're finally up the sun's already reached high noon. By the way, didn't you have plans to meet with Lena this morning? Lena came by to see if you were up, but you young men were still off in Never Never Land. You shouldn't break promises like that. Girls can be pretty scary if you make them angry. Oh, sorry, Ma. Weren't you supposed to meet with Lena? Hurry along and go apologize to her. Don't expect me to stick up for you if Lena ever decides to blow you off. She'd never do that. That would be bad. Then get your priorities straight and let her know how you feel. Understand? Tomorrow's a new day. Who knows what will happen? I think she just apologized. Lena, yes, there's a cat. Meow. <laughs> Sergey, check out this sawfish. Awesome, ain't it? I'll probably cut it down south by the El Nido Triangle. Nobody likes going down there, though. They all say it's creepy, but this sucker sure looks tasty. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Serge, what do you think of this sawfish? Have you ever seen one this size? Ha! <laughs> This has got to be from a legendary Dragon King palace. Wouldn't you agree? You're probably right. You think so too? I knew it. I just knew it. If it really is true, then from here on out, happiness will be rolling into my life. Business will pick up, money will start pouring in, and I'll be able to repair the roof. My varnish, well, my roof, varnish my boat, and buy a new sail. Eat as much squid gut pasta as I want to in Germaria. Ha! Life is good. Alright, who am I kidding? That would definitely be too good to be true. But thanks anyway, Serge. <laughs> thanks for playing along. Here's a little something for uh, for you to give a girl you like. Komodo scale. Serge received a Komodo scale without lifting a finger. I wish the legend was true, though. The Dragon Place Palace. There aren't enough dreams out there lately. Huh. Do frame. Iron plate. Oh, I thought he, that what he gave me was the no, maybe that was the rainbow thing. Day, isn't it? Sure feels great to be outside. Ah, just be able to bask in the sun all day. Sure is a nice change. They say the rain cleanses one's spirit, but our age, we've had enough cleansing. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I know. Wonder if those outsiders are back digging up now that the rain's let up. They must be conducting some kind of investigation up there in the Fossil Valley. I can't comprehend outsiders. Why would they want to dig up a place like that? Why, hello there, Serge. Can I interest you in something? I have some great elements. Would you like to take a look? Ah, oh, yes. Show me your weapons and armor, please. Sure, just one second. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, that's right. You gotta buy. You, you gotta kind of monster hunt and get shit. Show me your elements. Ba, ba, ba. Ba, ba, ba. I 
think I already have cure. Come again. Not have elements? Oops. I'm in the wrong thing. Oh. Ivory mail. Do I really not have elements? Mono scale, this is a beautiful. buy your elements, ma'am. I thought I started off with at least cure. Like, we will buy cure. We'll buy some medicine. Oh. Buy some antidotes. Fuck. Alright, well, I was gonna buy aqua beam too, but... Thanks, come again. Oops. All right, quit. Okay, there we go. Damn it. Stop it. He's got cure plus one. Um, cure plus two, there we go. Actually, give me medicine. Thank you. I knew he had stuff, damn it. Hey, Sergi! And do you know what's popular among village girls these days? A necklace made from Kimono dragon skills. You know, those monsters that eat fire. I want to get some for Kiki, but there's no way I can beat those monsters. Oh no, if I don't do something about this now, Kiki might start liking Lolo. Oh boy, am I in a fix. Right. Talk to you. Una. Yo, Sergi. I heard that you totally blew off Lena this morning. I didn't think you had it in you. That was real gutsy of you. I guess that kind of shows her who's boss, eh? Don't tell her I said that, but my sister's a bit too quick to lash out. Can you make her a little... Be me, make her be a little nicer to me? You know, have my support in all the way. I'll keep my fingers crossed for you. Ah, please, up ahead. Listen, don't be messing with those boats. I'm sure you'll understand. A boat is like a limb to a fisherman. But any stunts like last time, I don't whack you in the head. Wow, she's not nice. Hello there, Serge. Word is it that Komodo dragon skills are quite popular among the youngins these days. So you're collecting them too, huh? Wanna make a silly little necklace? Well, that's right. <laughs> well said, Serge. You're truly a man of the sea. They don't call me the Komodo dragon expert for nothing. Let me give you some pointers. Come on, clean out your ears and listen well. Serge, this is truly top secret. Let's see. My super duper secret number one, rock and roll to trap the sucker. Secret two, use the lay of the land and make a surprise attack. And number three, there's always one that likes to play tag. Run with all your might. <laughs> Be aware though, Komodo dragons are mighty cautious and run at high speeds. You must face him with your own witch, courage and tenacity. Here's your lightning start and run like the wind. Whip past them with all your might. Actually, I guess there's no point in overtaking them anyhow. 
is all about guts, my boy. Once you catch up to one, you must fight and kick that little sucker's butt. But don't get your own butt kicked. <laughs> anyway, that's all I can teach you. The ways of an expert. Now go, Serge. Go for the gold and bring forth a brighter tomorrow. Heh, <laughs> sorry. Isn't my Selena cute? Daddy found her by Lizard Rock. Well, a lot of baby kimono dragons play out there. I guess it's kind of their hangout. Oh, and did you know what, Sergi? Don't tell anyone, but I'm about to tell you a secret. It's a secret, okay? Lulu said he was going to get me some kimono dragon skills. <laughs> what should I do? Wow. Yeah, and if you bug it, she yells at you. She goes, Be nice! Do you know about the Lizard Rock, southwest of the village? I heard that there's a mother Komodo dragon who comes out every once in a while. I've told Kiki numerous times not to play there, but she never listens to me. I guess kids will be kids. Ow. Oh, uh, hi, Serge. I was lost in my thoughts here. You know how Kiki's growing up so quickly? Sometimes I'm just amazed at how much she rem resembles her mother. Yeah, I guess my wife is like that too. She's been very much like her mother since as long as I can remember. I guess that demonstrates how life continues to go on through the generations. It's about 10 years ago since I became a fisherman. Back then, I still had other inspirations, but I ended up succeeding my dad. I guess you can say that everything here represents 10 years of my life. Lion sharks, sawfish, six-horned norwhales, you name it, they represent all my hard work and dedication. I love my job and I'm happy with my current lifestyle and all, but lately I get to thinking when I see Kiki about how I could have had a different future. What if I chosen a different path 10 years ago? Then I'd be living a completely different life than I am now. I'm not saying which one would be better. I just wonder where the other path may have led me. I guess the longer you live, the more you wonder about the other you that it might have been. Boy, life is sure complex. Don't worry about it, though. Oh, hey, Serge. You want this? Here, take it. It's an amulet I made from a lion shark tooth ten years ago when I decided to become a fisherman. I don't need it anymore. I have my wife and Kiki watching over me. Serge, receive shark tooth. I just got this feeling there's another life waiting out for me. I have a funny feeling, it sounds crazy, huh? Uh, give him the amulet and tell him there's another you. Yep. I do remember that. There was so much I, I missed the, the very first time I played this. So much stuff I missed. Looks like the Viper Festival will be cancelled again this year. Only a celebration of El Nino Archipelago down the drain. There hasn't been anything good to talk about since the army from Poor took over the island three years ago. We haven't had to put up with the situation if General Viper and the Dragoons were still here. Okay, I forgot you're supposed to keep talking to people. Exhaust there. Yo, Serge, have you heard anything about the group of thieves up on the mainland? I haven't. You really haven't been keeping up, have you? It's pretty big news, even in El Nido. Those mysterious thieves have broken into a bunch of houses up on the mainland. They're cold-blooded bastards. They go to any extreme to get money or jewels. Even the powerful nation of poor can't seem to get a hold of them. I think they call themselves theoretical dreamers. Wouldn't want them run into those bandits. Oh. Shit. 
Yo, sir, do you want to hear about the group of things? Okay, don't fall asleep, listen to Path. In the past several years, a group of thieves have been causing havoc over the mainland. They're cold-blooded blasters. Okay. That, okay. I, I never liked that thing, even the original. Go away, you creepy monster. Who oh, mana, who oh, mana, who oh, mana. She's a pretty. What a knockout that dancer Miki is. The port town of Termina has a cheer for dancers, but no one, I say no one, compares to Miki. But mind you, I've never actually seen Mickey dance. Oh, I would have loved to see them jiggle. I mean, I'm talking about her arms, of course. Oh, Serge, don't tell Grandma about this. Oh, that's Grandpa. Tasty cha 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 cha, healthy cha cha cha. Why don't cha try my hair cream soup? That's my specialty. Soup made exclusively from haraka bones. I don't mean to brag, but nobody can make soup like I can. Cha cha ha ha ha. Hello, Serge. Do you want to hear about the real truth about the world? Sure. Insanity leads to chaos, then to solitude. Frivolous efforts of adding meaning to what is meaningless. A lone crimson tear falls into the sea. The echo of the remaining star cries out at the infant vacuum. The least I can do is send my distant prayers over the wind of time setting sail on dreams. Well, did you like it, Serge? Are you moved? I've been dreaming about becoming a poet since I was little. I want to cross the continent and make a name for myself with just a pencil and paper. But look at me. I'm in this puny village in the middle of nowhere, waitressing in this rundown shack. What you say about my restaurant? You quit any time you know. X! Just kidding. I was just kidding. I was just saying how good the work environment is. Yeah. Uh, thanks. You really mean like, um, my fan club. I thought she gave you something for listening to it. That's why. Did I hear a little goblin thing? Ivory helmet. Awesome. more time You, Serge. Oh, oh, just don't go near the Hydra Marshes out to the east, okay? You don't want you to run it over you wars in that Hydra now. So why don't you go talk to the village chief before I set out? Uh, his house is just past those gates on yonder. You saw fearful day, huh? You got me dozing off there. Yep. Uh, do you like, by the way, I can't speak, Serge. Do you like the sea? Yeah. Oh, really? 
Yes, yeah, sure, the seems great, but remember, Sarge, don't take it too lightly. Usually you'll find the sea to be vast, deep, full of strength and energy, yet kind and gentle. Uh, but once it becomes angry, yeah, it can take a turn in the most frightening monster you've ever seen. Engulfing everything. Close your eyes and pick up, prick up your ears. You can hear the cries of countless men swallowed by the sea. The hidden secret. The whispers of the sea. I recommend you to learn the senses of the moon and the sea. As if you don't want to join the fellows at the bottom already. I haven't been to Water Dragon Island in a while. You can catch great fishes over there. But once... I, oh, but I only go there once in a blue moon. I want to leave them in peace. Okay, I remember going there. You're late, Serge. Sleeping in as usual, I suppose. You promised you'd go get me some kimono dragon scales for my neck, for my necklace. Remember? Since you were late, Mom asked me to babysit the kids. Oh, hey, Sergey, Lena, look at me! Come on, guys. You should join us. It feels really good. Unlike the rest of you, we're not here to play. Don't swim out too far now. Okay, gotcha. Kids sure have it easy. Remember when we were like that? Not a single care or worry on our minds. How each day lasted an eternity, filled with newness, fun, and excitement. Not that old. But the important thing now is that is not our childhood, but my Komodo scale necklace. Yes, we have to face up to reality and live each day anew. So, I want you to go to Lizard Rock and get me some scales. I would join you, but I still have to watch the kids. It's your fault you were late. Once you've collected some Komodo dragon skills, I'll catch up with you at Opasa Beach. Is that okay with you? Sure, no problem. Good. That's what I wanted to hear. Okay then. Don't just stand around. Go collect some scales at Lizard Rock. Let's see. I think three should be enough. Good luck, Surge. I'm counting on you. I've already got one. Bam, 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 bam. All right, so I'm going to pause this for a second. Um, when I did a little stream of Chrono Trigger, I uploaded that to YouTube. And some group that tried to get a Kickstarter for the music to perform at a concert, they actually false DMCA'd, not DMCA'd, but they false copyright claimed um, that, uh, that VOD. And when I looked them up, they actually did not succeed in getting the funds. And they tried to claim the music as their own, which was funny, because it wasn't their music to begin with. But yes. So I'm worried that something like that might happen again with this. I am not 100% sure. Can I actually go up in here? Oh, yeah. This is my house. Enter at your own risk. Good morning, Serge. Don't tell me you just woke up. Don't you know that the early bird gets the worm? It is over at the pier. Looks like her mother asked her to babysit. <coughs> you used to cry and run away at the mere sight of a pussycat. Do you remember? You're about yay high. You were attacked by a panther demon. I guess it left an emotional scar. But it's good that you've overcome that fear. Girls will think you're a weenie. Running away from cats. I don't remember. You're supposed to be able to spin these.
Redis. Oh, Serge, how does it go? How would you like to join everyone for my lecture? Today's lecture is the fundamental of attack and the arts of the element. <coughs> sure. Excellent. A true man you are. Well then, let's get out with it. Oh, shit. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> Come on, Sarge, don't hold back. Ready is. First, here's some basic advice on attacking. So listen up, young one. You know there are three different attack levels. One weak, two strong, three fierce. Each having a different accuracy or hit values. Don't you? Every time you hit an opponent, each of these values increases, making it easier for your next attack to hit the mark. A good strategy is to start with weak blows, which have the highest chance of succeeding, then building up to strong and fierce blows. So rather than attacking willy nilly, you should be a uh, you should aim to build up your hit. If your fierce three attacks don't hit home, you're just wasting energy. Oh no! Weak, strong, fierce. Ho ho ho! Not even close. Don't be trust me with your hit too much there, boy. As long as not 100%, you still risk of missing it continuously. Sometimes if you, it pays to muster up the courage to use strong and fierce. Okay. That's what I tried to do. Fierce. Oh. Oh, no. Next, let's check out the use of element. When you use an element, the color of the element's attribute remains on the battlefield in the form of a field effect. Each time you consistently use the same element, the effectiveness of that uh, colored element groups increase. Here, I'll show you. Let's fill up the field meter attributes with the blue color. Try using a blue blue element after me. Turn blue! Hey there, hurry up and turn all the fields. Okay. Do you know how to use the elements or something? I'll tell you one of the. Okay, sorry, I'm taking this in too. So why don't you try using some of those glue on this boys? Relax the spin. Okay, otherwise. I'm a spirit above smoke time to do the sample of physical elements, yes. Oh my god, so much! See, the field is completely blue. Any blue elements, you know, I can punch here. Try this out. But oh, oh, oh. was that too much for you? Sorry about that, youngin. Uh, conversely, when there's a lot of blue in the field, attributes and elements of the opposing color red will be weakened. 
So, try to discern your enemy's attack pattern and fill the field with the opposite color of his attacks as a form of defense. That strategy of using elements is sure to come in handy, so put it to good use, Sonny! Ho ho, what was that? You learned something there, boy. Anyway, I guess it's time to bring this lesson to an end. Here you go! Yeah! You son of a... You died. Uh, pooped already, eh? And you're still so young. Oh, well, don't let it get you down. Come again anytime, sonny. And then everything just come out of Chief Freddy's told me. And now all that the eggs in my body are gone. What a fine man our chief is. Skilled, competent, caring. I heard he was quite a warrior in his prime. You could learn much from our chief. Grow up to be like great man like Radius. The record of the fates tell us. Tells me today is not to go out to sea. That's what I came here. The chief's lecture. Go against the record of fate, and you'll sure regret it for sure. Days like this, it's best to take easy. Maybe we should all live in harmony with fate. Hey, Sergi, I'm Gunjir. You know all and see all. Well, I can tell you need to know about how to use items. Yes, tell me. Good. Good, I'd be happy. Now listen carefully. You already know how to do it. So, when you want to give someone a key item, we're talking press X and it'll bring up the menu item. Then, then pick the item you wish to hand over and confirm the set. Oh, okay. Same procedure when you use a key item to specific location. No worry about the mistakes. The item won't disappear if there's no response. Well, that's about it. Come back. Hey, Sergio, want to know a secret about Pushal? Sure, tell me. Okay, but keep it a secret. Ready? Pushal is such a pig. When it comes to eating, she'll do anything for her favorite dish. Very unlater like, isn't it? Tempted by food. What's her favorite food? Come here, dog. Oh, me a bit busy right now. Maybe next time. I'm stuck. If there's anything back here, I don't remember if there was. I feel like there was. Yo, my name's Tom of the 14th, but people usually go by the Great Explorer. In front of my name. Great Explorer, Tama. I was just looking around for treasure. I have a sixth sense, you know. Yo, I wasn't gardening. I was really looking for treasure. I think that's where I find the bone. Time sure does fly. Chief Fredius has been living here for four years already. He's such a bright, cheerful man. Everyone in the village really likes him. I wish he could stay here forever. That's exactly right, Serge. There it is. The record of fate. It records everything. Good or bad. If you happen to cross one of these, don't forget to record everything you've done so far. Think of how terrible it would be if you lost your past. There wouldn't be anything you can do about it. If you listen closely, the record of fate will tell you lots of things, like what you should be doing next, and what you can't hear anything anymore. Well, I guess it means you don't have a future. Uh, when that happens, you should just go home and go to sleep. There isn't anything anyone can do to change fate. If you want to record what you've already done so far, step up to the record of record of fate and record, open the menu. Then select the block you want to follow the directions safe. It's easy, isn't it? Oh, but you should go look for another one. I'm going to be here for a while. Oh yeah, if you go out to the world map, you can save without a record of fate. 
the block she's talking about is the PS1 memory. Surge can be f uh, surge found cure behind the frame. Ooh. Well, I guess I didn't need to buy it. Ash. We came all the way out here in search for a legendary treasure, but our funds ran out. Once I'm done cleaning in here, I'll have to do some yard work. We gotta do something to cover our expenses. If I knew this was gonna happen, I wouldn't have tried to persuade Sir Talma to look for the treasure on the Zanara continent. Oh. That is a clue about where some treasure's at. Oh, it's you, Serge. I think the chief's outside. He said he was going to teach some stuff about self-defense. He may be old, but he still has some fight left in him. You kids better not misbehave, or else the chief will have to come crack on you all. Yes. Ha, ah, ah, yeah, yeah. Where are you going? Hey. I do kind of miss the the icons wow. for the old PS1 memory uh, saves. You can't really go here, but just to show you what's going on. The Pori Army is currently investigating this area. It's off limits to the general public. We will inform you when our investigation is complete. Now scram! Oh, I don't save. We shall save here. There is an oasis here, but again, there's nothing there to get. Hydra Marshes. Why, if it isn't Serge, didn't the village elders tell you not to come here? But I really want to come here, man. We're going to go grind in here for a bit. To level up! Remember this if this hurts you. Yeah, I think it does. The heal. Yeah. Da -da 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 No! Yeah! Uh. Yeah, I don't have any fire attacks, damn it, or whatever. Damn it. Whoa, no! I need that for uh, making weapons. Uh, I'm also coming in here to level up too. Oh no, the beach bum! Ah! Ba -ba -ba -da -da.
Got him. These guys are a bit more aggressive than my first play. Uh, Cause these guys just kept missing. As a kid, I thought his weapons were so cool. The kind of dual blade things, because I hadn't seen anything like that, and I don't think um, Dark Menace had come out yet. Star Wars. Phantom Menace, sorry, not the Dark Menace. I know shit! Surge and Lena forever. So the Radical Dreamer thing came out as a, from what I read, because I never knew it existed. I never knew it existed. I knew about the first game a little bit, but it was something I never really played. Oh, come on. Um, but from what I read, Radical Dreamers was a... A novel, like a choose-your-own-adventure type novel thing. Damn it. Ba -ba -ba -da. Get out of here! Whoa! This is a game where you will have to grind a little bit. Because if you don't, certain areas can get uh, rather hard. Well, hello, and welcome to the stream. I just started playing this. It's been, I don't know how many, how many years since I played it. Uh, well more than two decades, I can tell you that. So it's more than 20 years. Damn, I'm doing shit. No! Ah! Uh. Come here, Fang Fang. Oh, it was on the poop hole. I I know a lot of people aren't gonna be quite happy with the remake. That's fine. Debating on whether or not to buy in the soundtracks. Uh, not the vinyl ones, though. I think Surge is actually supposed to be a red element. But for right now. Do you remember the different weapons have different elements to them? Oh, Sid Alpha just released the video. Fireball! Alright, there we go. Let's remove uh, 
I think I'm gonna have to need that though. Oh, right. I gotta get up there and drop down on him. Ba -da -da. That was easy. lag, but all right. Now I wanted to level up because I remember I think you have to fight the mother Komodo dragon and she's a bit hard if you don't. I'll get him in a minute after I kill this dude. Probably should have defended. Getting a lot of humor and fangs.
Get him! Bing, bing, bong. Supposed to be able to drop that. There we go. In the original, you just tell the press A and it would do that for you, I believe. Silver Loaf. This is Silver Loaf. Damn it. Damn it. We did it! Yay! where the Mama Komodo Dragon lives. Get it on you! There we go. Sand squirt. No. Roast him. Hell yeah. Blue balls. Blue balls. Whoops. Blue balls. Ready for a pass speech. I know I have about three. But I want to make sure I get all the other stuff too. Maybe some of that stuff I can't get?
Get him. Oh. This is gonna hurt. Reached a new growth level. Man, I thought I had to go down there to fight the Komodo. Maybe this is... I'm thinking about when the timeline changes. It's probably what I'm thinking. you are. Sorry I'm late. I hope that you didn't wait too long, Serge. Well, how did it go? Did you get the Commander Dragon Scales? No, they're beautiful. I'll be able to make a great necklace with these. Thank you, Serge. Sure, it's been a long time since we last came here. We used to come here often. I don't remember it being so dangerous. The sea never changes, does it? It's been rolling in and out like this since long before we were born. It's been here for an eternity. It seems, it probably seen many things heard many things. It'd probably keep rolling in and out and out long after a lifetime without a single change. Hey Serge, remember the time we sat and talked like this back when we were kids? With the gentle sea breeze and the tranquil sound of the waves? Just the two of us talking? Do you still remember that day? No, I remember everything. Really? You do? So you haven't forgotten about the promise we made that day? <laughs> Makes me happy. But aren't memories strange? Just when you think about you've forgotten about something, it comes floating back into your heart. I guess I was just... It was just lying there and wait. Waiting for the right moment. I actually don't remember the memory. Why? We might even remember this very moment someday. In 10, 20 years, when we're all grown up, married, and have our own kids. When that time comes, I wonder what kind of adults will be. What kind of life will I be leading? We'll never forget this day. Yeah, I hope you're right. Serge, there's been something I've been wanting to... Something popped up and I missed it. 
Surge. What? What's wrong, Surge? Surge? Is it Cell? Jesus. What are you doing there, boy? It's dangerous to sleep out there. Are you alright, boy? What on the earth are you doing laying down anyway? For a second there, I thought you might have been a dead body. Watch to show her. I don't remember nothing. Where'd Lena go? Well, where's Lena? You were the only one here when I got here. Are you friends with Lena? I believe she's babysitting in the village. Well, I'd be up to be on my way. And if I were looking for Lena, you should stop by the village. You know, you shouldn't be playing out here, boy. Wouldn't want anything to happen to you now. Get out of here, you weirdo. Look at me. I thought there was a secret treasure chest somewhere back here, maybe. No. Wow. Yeah, the music's changed. See? Danger, keep out. I'm gonna save it because I don't remember if those things are hard to beat or not. Fish. Did it. Still can't go that way, huh? How do I get up over there?
Burn fish. Oh no. <laughs> I killed him with one hit. All right. I'm OP. Ba -da -da -da. These things ever stop coming? Well, that was weird. All right. the critical hit. I think I actually have to hunt these things later for their scales. Get out of here, fish! Cut you in two. Alright. <laughs> oh, I just. Ugh. 
barely killed that poor little Komodo. You need OP out here. Says no. Oh, Says I'm only at some level. No, that's my. It's my element, not my actual level. I'm doing this mainly for uh, some of it to level up, but mainly for resources. Because I will need be needing new equipment and stuff shortly, so. come from it's kind of hard to see when it, the screens off like that cut off like that oh no Something's going on. People keep messaging me on Facebook. Or not Facebook, but Messenger. Oh, it's gone. Alright, well. Let's get out of here. Back to town. to this quiet seaside village. There isn't much, it, much excitement here, but please relax and stay a while. Yes, yes, Viper Festival is going to be some event. There's going to be a famous traveling band there. You see that poster over there? He's the lead guitarist, a vocalist of the band. He dresses flamboyantly, but he drives the women mad. Young and old, puts on a powerful show too. What? Yo, stranger, have you heard anything about the group of thieves up on the mainland? Yes, I have. Well, I guess the news travels fast, even from down on this island. They're called the Dragon. Rat. <laughs> Almost a dragon. Radical. So, like, I mix between radical and dragon. Radical dreamers, about to show offs. They have no different, they're no different from psycho killers. So many freaks out in this world these days. I guess it's just a sign of the times. Hummer, 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 what a hunk. There he is, Nikki from the Magical Dreamers. As luck would have it, Nikki's holding a concert in the port town of Tamaria. And there is heaven on air. It pays to live to an old age. But I believe I'm actually good. Wait, I, I can't believe I'm actually going to be able to hear Nikki's beautiful voice. I got him at one point. Oh, stranger, don't tell Gramps about this. She doesn't say anything to me. Hi there. Haven't seen you around before. Are you from Tamaria? So how's it going? I bet everyone's really excited about the Viper Festival. What? My poems? What are you talking about? I gave them up ages ago. It was just a stupid dream I was obsessed with. Never did have any talent for it. But how'd you know about that? 
Nobody knows about my poetry. It really doesn't matter anymore whether I'm writing poems or not. Nobody would give a hoot about someone writing poems in a tiny little cafe in the middle of nowhere. Oh, tiny little cafe in the middle of nowhere, huh? But just remember, dreams do come true. Huh. Do you honestly believe that? We live in the middle of nowhere, in this tiny village, living small lives. Nothing's ever going to change that, no matter how hard you try. That's just reality of it all. Sigh. Hello, young man. What can I do for you? What happens... To, uh... Hmm? What happened to the cook that speaks with me, you ask? Oh, you mean my lesser half, my husband? He went on a journey to brush up on his cooking. I have no idea where he could be. I don't know if I can go back here. So... Hey, stranger, you know what's popular among girls these days? Bracelets made from rainbow shells. I want to get some for Kiki, but those uh, shells are so hard to find. Oh no, if I don't do something about this now, Kiki might start liking Lolo. Boy, am I in a fix. Oh, hi. Are you new here? Lena? I think she's babysitting on the pier. She could be on the pier. Are you a friend of Lena's? transfers, you know. You gotta slap her in the face before she opens up her mouth. I'm sure if she gets herself a boyfriend, she'll act more ladylike. I can't comprehend my son anymore. He hasn't worked in years. There was a time when he had his heart set on becoming a man of the sea. Just like me. But look at him now. Praying to that silly looking doll. Day and night. What's gotten into him? Uh... Ten years ago, my husband lost a son. The boy drowned at sea at the tender age of seven. And soon after, the boy's parents passed away too. Such a sad turn of events. That's when my hun husband changed. Never did I imagine he would end up like this. He's... His way of life has completely changed. Daddy always spends his time downstairs. He won't play with me. And he gets real mad if I go down there too. He didn't used to be like that. I don't think he likes me anymore. You can get that character. This dude. The Lancer seems just to be a straw doll. Felt the aura of longevity from the Ari of the Cat. Not. Well, that was new. Received the sacred look ago from the Licky Cat. Not. Felt the beam of life from the Lazy Cat. Not. Well, hello there. I just finished praying. Here, take a look. It's called Mojo. It's a good luck charm from the Far East. Can you feel the love and the affection oozing from it? It's just such an amazing message of love and courage. Think about it, my brother. How? Our everyday lives are controlled by uncertainty and fear. Our spent yesterdays and uncertain tomorrows. How we live a meaningless life today. This whole item filled with prayer protects and supports us. Come, my brother. Let us pray together and bring peace of mind to our hearts. Where can you find true love? A peace of mind within Mojo.
Shark tooth from a vicious lion shark. And the look of the size of this thing. Just judging by the size, this baby must have been a good 15 feet. Don't tell me you're the one who caught it. What? What did you say? Another me? So the other me who, who became a fisherman asked you to give this to me? Hi. What are you talking about? That's enough. There's only one me. How can there be another me out there? How? How can... Sure, there was a point in my life when I thought about becoming a fisherman. That was a good ten years ago. But I couldn't do it. I gave up that path. Right then and there. I just gave up. I don't care what you say. This is the path I choose, and I don't regret it. Besides, you can't change the way you live in the blink of an eye. No. Now, would you please put that thing away and leave me alone? I have nothing more to say. Now please leave. Back when we were young, my husband would talk about how he would take a shark tooth amulet out to sea, and I really don't know what to believe or to go on, especially when you realize life doesn't turn out what you expect. Wow, is this is amulet made from a real lion's tooth? My daddy once told me that the men of the seas take amulets like that out for good luck. I wonder if daddy will be able to his old self again. Why? Oh, what do you have here? An amulet made from a lion shark tooth? That shark must have been huge. Don't tell me you're the one who caught it, boy. Had my son become a man of the sea, he would have had no problem tackling his lion shark of that size. But look at him now, just wasting his life away. Where did he go wrong? I didn't raise him like that. Another day is going to be a scorcher today. It hasn't rained in quite a while. I don't know how much much longer us old timers can stand this heat. And by the way, I wonder if those knights are still digging that hole. I don't know what those Demarian knights are up to. I heard they're digging in Fossil Valley. I am sure General Viper has a good reason. But why would they want to dig up a place like that? Have you heard anything about the El Nino Triangle down south? Everyone says it's really creepy down there. Some say you can hear strange voices. Some even claim to have seen a huge glowing egg down there at the bottom of the sea. I tell you, adults are superstitious. They try to act all tough, but this kind of stuff scares them. Uh, I just haven't been able to hit a big one lately, you know. I'm not really concerned about money or profit. I just have this urge for a challenge. Come on, baby. I know you're out there. I need some excitement. Give me a big catch. Huh. That's an amulet made from a huge shark tooth. Monster, don't tell me you're the one who caught it. Up ahead, listen, don't be doing any mischief on them boats. A boat is like a limb to a fisherman, but I guess our son is like you would never understand. You're right, he wouldn't. Greetings, Shani. You're a new face in this village. A friend of Lena, perhaps. You'll find her out in the pan babysitting. 
Hey, my name is the boy who lived next door. I was terrified of cats. That was more than ten years ago. That boy was attacked by a panther demon. And when he was very young, I guess that left an emotional scar. Poor boy, no one that would ever m imagine such a tragedy would take place several years later. This is my huddle. Keep out and beware of mad hackers. We have embarked on a long uh, road journey. Please do not come working for I. I need to give him some type of bone or her bone. What are you doing in here, man? This is my island. Well, let me rest here for a little while, man. So you want to rest, man? Man. Who? Who are you? What are you doing in my house? My house isn't a playground for kids, all right? Go outside and play. Who? Marge? Who the heck's that? I've lived in this house for five years now. That name doesn't ring a bell. Whatever with all your gibberish, man. Just get out of here. But... This is my house. My house. Clippy! That! Uh, oh, tranquil sounds of the wave. It does make me sleepy every time. But the lullaby we heard in our mother's womb was kind of like this. One day we'll all return to Mother Sea, embraced by her lullaby. A uh, new chorus. Yeah, okay. Is that a Komodo dragon scale? Ah, that's disgusting. Get away from me. Who, who are you? Have we met someone before? Are you from Tamaria? Hey! Hey, you! Don't be trying to pull moves on Arlena, you jerk! Don't be silly. Don't go out swimming too far, you hear? Okay, gotcha! Kids. I guess kids will be kids. Don't worry about them. Hmm. You know... You look like a, a lot like the boy who used to live next door to me. Oh, I am. What was... What happened to him? What happened to him? Why do you want to know? It's really none of your business. That boy died. He drowned when he was very young. This all happened ten years ago. Soon after, his mother passed away too. I was still very young back then. So I don't remember too well, but my mom said his name was Surge. Surge. That's time surge. That's nonsense. What? Why would I lie to something like that? Don't you think I'd make something grow up with something like that? That boy. I guess I kind of liked him. If that boy were still alive, I wondered what would have become of us. Sure, it's weird. Why am I opening it up to like this? Well, I guess it's like there's no use thinking about the past. It's not like Switch would come back. Mom always tells me I shouldn't dwell on the lost of loved ones. But you can find his grave up under Cape Howe. Actually, why don't you go visit his grave site? No one's been up there in a while. Well, I still have some chores to finish. Sorry I blew up on you like that. Goodbye, stranger.
I didn't drown. What the hell is all this shit? Between you and me, our chief Gojin is really stingy. I can't cook a decent meal if I don't have the fresh ingredients. And then he complains about how terrible the food tastes. I can't stand it. That's right, the regular fate records everything for us, good or bad. So when the time comes to bid adieu, our life story will be recorded. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only the record, only the things the record of fate doesn't touch upon are birth and death. I don't really mind. I don't really want to think I want to know about it. More importantly, when should I see Firth, uh, Firth at the festival of Temeria? Hmm, should I go catch Nick at the concert, the Mermaid Dance Show? Hmm, I want to see... Every time I come to the decision, I wonder what would have happened if I decided the other way. Maybe I should have done this instead of that. Maybe I made the wrong decision. But luckily, we have the record of fate that tells us exactly what choices to make. I can't imagine life without it. Every day would be filled with anxiety and fear. No cutting in line. Get back on the line. Tablet. Eh, here a new face around here. And we don't get too many visitors. My name's Genji. I'm the chief of Arnie. Yeah, why don't you stay and rest a while? I, I do have uh, plenty of scrolls of my identification. Stay a while and listen. Can't offer any extra ever get entertainment, but make yourself at home. Yes. Do you want to see the chief? Hmm? Radius? Who's that? Arch Gunji's our chief. There's no one by here by that name. You must be mistaken. Don't care. All right, we will go meet Kid, and then we will probably end the stream. there's anything let's check let's check this out oh there it is years ago these falls were considered a holy place by the worshippers of the divine dragon faith then the hordes of humans began to migrate to these islands and we were pushed into the outlying religions in the cultural takeover the, that ensued the spiritual significance of this place was such as soon forgotten in the old days, many of my friends and fellow believers would come here to worship. It was quite lively, particularly during the festive seasons. Oh, how I miss those days. We can't let you in until our investigation is complete. Hey, Captain, you found anything yet? but I don't think it'll let me. Yeah, not yet. Several years ago, when all the hydras died off, this woodland became covered with a thick fog and the waters became polluted and acidic. But the real cause of us, uh, cause was us killing, uh, humans killing off the flora and fauna. I just hope we didn't come to regret the destruction we caused. for that. I 
right, you have to have a special suit to get in there, that's right. Welcome to death. Man. Not the goopy water. There's a skull right there. I'm standing on. Maybe some for a warning, some for a boating. There's something written on the tombstone. Rest in peace, our beloved Surge died age seven. Nobody can take anything from him now, nor can anyone give him, give him, give anything to him. What came from the sea has returned to the sea. So, you must be the ghost boy who died ten years ago, Surge. Oh, it's a different dude. Don't move. It's no use. There's no escape. That way, all you can do is come with us. But Sir Kanash, uh, don't you think it's tr uh, truly true that this chap's a ghost? He seems like a perfect young boy to me. That doesn't matter. We found the boy here, just as he said we would, didn't we? Now seize him! Hold your... Oh man, that wouldn't go way too fast. Who the? Oh, I don't have an electrical bolt thing. Out of the way, Missy. We don't want to get hurt. Well, you don't want to get hurt now, do you? Shut your trap. Yeah, the wines is better get out of the way. Uh, do you have a problem? Do you have a shaking idea who you're dealing with, Missy? That's enough. Listen up, Junior. Our orders are to take you in. We don't want to hurt you. Just come with us. Or else this axe of mine will have to do the talking. For crying out loud, would you just shut up and get on with it? I'm going to kick your sorry asses so hard you'll kiss the moons. 
Fair enough. You leave us no choice. You'll regret this, Missy. I do remember these guys. Salt. Sir, inherently innate element colors to, uh, colors is white. Right, that does it. Quick attack him with the opposite element color, black. How unfortunate, sir. I don't seem to have any. You nincompoop. Should always carry elements of every color. Then, how about you over there? I'm shaking in my shoes to tell you this, sir. But I don't have any either. <coughs> I'll have to let you know, Sir Cash. Yeah, show us how it's done. Useless fools. All right, real men don't need magic when they can fight with their might. Bust him up. Got him. See, yay. Bone axe, ivory vest, ivory helmet. Oh, Sir Karsh, I shall we say we should get out of here. For you, Missy, we won't forget this. Oh, I'm so scared. I'll be happy to take you on any time. I am lose to scum like you. Ha! <laughs> I think I'll lose to scum like you. You all right, mate? Yeah. Serge, your name's Serge, ain't it? Huh. Oh, me? Mine's. I'm just gonna call her a kid, because that's her name.
I always thought that was a stupid name, but I realized as I got older it's a pirate's name. Captain Kidd. Call me Kid. Nice to meet you. I just couldn't stand by and watch those blokes gang up on you like that. They just pissed me the bloody hell off. I wish I could have beaten them some more. By the way, what's that mob after you? What do you mean you've never been mad at before, eh? I forget it. Hey, Sitch. How about you and me team up for a while? That cashier fella ain't gonna leave you alone, that's for sure. And to tell you the truth, I'm new to these islands. It's pretty lonely traveling around here on my own. <laughs> so how bad is it? Maybe if it was fate that would meet up like this. Travel together. Um. For the play first playthrough, I will do travel together, and then later I will the second one I will do refuse. Pretty, mate. That decides it then. Best mates now. Anyway, it'll be getting dark soon. I guess we gotta head up to Arnie and shack up for the night. Oh, and search. Don't go trying any funny stuff just because I'm cute now. What? <laughs> Oi, let's get our asses down to Tamaria. Oh, mate, I nearly forgot. Let me give you this. It's a teleporter. You'll be able to switch your party members from afar. A real handy gadget. All you have to do is, uh, let me pin it to your, uh, pin it in the arse to explain. Look it up in the menu. kind of all over for right now um, just because uh, equipment ivory mail ivory vests Kid, give me a break, man. What do you want from me? I told you, I don't know any more Sarge or Marge.
Hold on there. What, what was that? Love is always in the head. It's just that no one notices. Yo, Mojo. Hi, Mojo, and I bring good fortune. Bagoom! This can't be happening. How in the... I sent some kind of purpose. Seems like fun. So I'll join you. Wait a sec. Oh, there's nothing to roll about me. I uh, just want advice. Stop running around and come to face to face with your life. Ah. A messenger of love and courage I am. I'm lucky, lucky, lucky. <laughs> The decision I made wrong? So then, what have I been doing in my past 10 years? Okay, give him this now. So they're saying this. I never got him on early on this game because I didn't know that I was supposed to give the dude the shark tooth. I think I didn't talk to the guy all the way about that, so. Got ivory mail, bone glove. What you got, my guy? Um, I will give you. Weapons I'm fine for right now, I'll buy, I'll buy stuff later. Um, aqua ball. Who's got electrical bolt? Is it you? So he's white, she's red. So you know what?
I guess it's fine for now. I mean, she's fire. I also want to go with blue with him. Um, Alrighty. I got him pretty early on in the game. I'm happy about that. I do remember he was like a, super, a character that I missed that I got so far in the game, and then I think I started a new game and found out how to got, get him. Uh, but we are going to save here. And we're actually going to end the stream here. Thank you all for joining me. I know we didn't dive too much into the game, but there's a lot to do. There's a lot to do in this game. So I'm going to end it here for now. There's going to be so much to do in this game. I quite love this game. I love the music. It's been such a long time since I played this game. I'm glad this came out. I know a lot of people are ripping into it and saying negative things about it. I've only had a few hiccups there, here and there. Um, I'm also not going to shit on a game that is old and that they kind of did a remaster for but it's not really a remaster so you can't really call it a remaster because they didn't put the remaster title on it they just called it the uh, radical dreamers edition because it did come up the radical dreamer thingy and i'll see you on the next one if you want to hit that follow button I'd be much appreciated. That way you can stay in the loop on when I'm streaming and what games I've been playing. Or you can follow me on Ramen Writer SPG over on YouTube. And you can see my stuff that way. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dreadbread. And this has been Chrono Cross. And I'll see you all later. Until next time, bye-bye. Wow.